Hi everyone, Liam Magpie here and today I've got something Sylvanian families related and it's been a long time since I've done Sylvanian families on my channel but I got this as a present for Christmas and it's actually from Japan um, so if you want this set I would recommend get, getting Amazon um, Japan and they ship really fast to the UK or if you're from America, from America for some reason, this set isn't out in any other places other than Japan. And I think it's very unusual to have a pony um, critter because we've not actually had any pony critters other than the actual, you can get horses what came out years ago. So this is one salon set and then there's an actual other salon you can buy as the salon shop. But this is the set, I'm going to set this up in my Sylvanian family's collection slash village in the grand apartment store just for now until i can get the salon it's quite expensive but this was quite cheap because i've already checked on the price this was 20 something pounds um and i've actually got another pony set as well i'm going to do a review on so if you love Salvanian families please like and subscribe to my channel and i also have an instagram what I do photography on there or advertise what I'm next going to review. I always called that my Instagram the, it's more like for cutesy toys like Sylvanian families, squish fillers, um, Pokemon, them sort of toys. And this is um, going to go in my grand apartment store and it's such a cute, unusual um, set. And it's really cute as well because... All of the Salvanians don't have like doll hair so this one is a bit unique and different and that's why I wanted it for Christmas it's actually been out for a little while now and the salon has but because I was getting it for Christmas I wanted to wait and do a review on it and um, but I haven't really seen much reviews on this set so it's a nice a nice little Thing for me to do a review on and the packaging is really cute it's got like stars and pearls and just it's very it's very um whimsical and cute the setup the it's like pinks and purples and bluers and it's very unusual that we've got um, a pony critter this time so that's why i've bought another set with two other little ponies which i'll do a review of them as well so if you love Sylvanian families or just a mixed range of toys subscribe to my channel and yeah there isn't much more I can say I'm going to um the back of the packaging shows you some this is the salon and this is the set what we get and you get loads of accessories you get like a little trolley and you get like a mirror with some accessories to go on there so it's really cute but um, I'm actually going to buy another one of these ponies so I can actually make one into a mum and one into a dad. And then you get the two other little ponies and they're going to be the children. Because they've not actually come up with like a full family, they're all separate um, figures for these, for, this, for these sets. And in this set... On the side of the box is everything what's included. Obviously, it's all in um, Japanese writing, but you can see it comes with one figure, a mirror, um, a hairdryer, scissors, comb, straighteners, and some other little bits and bobs. So, yeah, I can't wait to get um, the salon, and I will show you my um, setup, because on my channel, if you love Sylvanians, I have got a big collection and i did um a sylvanian families village what i've set up and it's a really nice display so if you want to check that out on my channel check it out because it's absolutely incredible i i spent a long time doing it and i've this will be my this is my third um show and tell of that village slash collection and then when i get my salon and get um some extra other pieces I'm going to do another, another like, I'll call it my part four of how far I've gone and um, got up to with my display. But without further ado, I'm going to get this really cute set out of the packaging. So everyone, I've got everything out of the packaging. I'm going to show you all the accessories first as it comes 
with quite a lot of accessories. So I'm going to take Mrs. Airdresser Pony out of the picture for a sec. So obviously it comes with this like trolley or cart. It's got quite a little bit of um, detail, but it's a bit plain coloured. It's just one colour. It's all one standard. The wheels don't go around, which is a bit disappointing to be honest that they don't go around. Um, but it's still got some nice little ridges and detail there. And it's in this nice little lilac -y purple, like purple colour. It's got some slots for some of the other accessories. So it is cute, but it's just a bit standard and plain. Um, the same goes with this little tray, which I think just goes on the top of here, or at the bottom, whichever you, however you want it. I like how um, Salvanians are very compatible. And then it comes with some little scissors. And they're really cute as well. And they actually open and close. And then we've got some little hair clips in a really nice sky blue colour. As you can see there. And they clip open and you can clip them into the actual um, pony's hair. As you can see there, they're really cute and adorable. And then we've got a little light blue hairband with some flower details on them as well. And then we have some like little a spray bottle, which is a really cute little sky blue colour as very, very cute. They don't come with no stickers. As far as I could see in the packaging, which Salvanians are very known for you and um, getting stickers, but they haven't put none on, on these, which I don't really like stickers anyway. They're quite um, annoying to put on, but for these sets, it would have been quite nice just to add that little more, a little bit more detail. But yeah, it's got like a little shampoo bottle, and it's in this nice like mint greeny blue colour. Then it's got um, a mixing bowl for, I think, hair dye. And it's got a real nice bit of detail on this one as it's got like a little bow inside and then a little bow on the handle here. So that's a nice little touch that I've added there. And this is in this nice little mint green colour. Then they've got this, I think this is the hair dye bottle, which is just in like a faded whitish pink and then another little pink at the top which is really cute. Then it's got some little clippers or shavers in like a gold colour. They're not really detailed, but you do get quite a lot of accessories. Then we've got like a little um, brush, what you use to apply the hair dye on, which is quite nice and detailed. It's got some little brown bristles, just to add a little bit more realistic to the sets itself. And then we've got this other little like it's like a draw tray which is cute it matches the um in the uk we'll call them either trolleys or you can call them like um i forgot what the name's called now i'll come back to that but yeah it's just like a little tray with a little bow detailing on the front then we've got some straighteners which actually open and close and they've got little handles so you can put Put them in the hands like this, which I think is so cute. And yeah, that's really cute accessory as well. And then it's got um, a little brush or a comb with a little bit of um, a bow detail. So I've noticed that it, they're very into the bow details. And then last of all, we've got oh no, the other two things we've got is a little mirror. Which I think is really cute. It's got some bits of detail in there. And that's a little hand mirror. And it's got a handle on it. So you can actually. They can open the mirror. And then we've got a hair dryer. Which has also got a handle. So the critters can hold the hair dryer. And it's in a light pink colour. A little bit of detail. But yeah the accessories are quite plain. But there is quite a lot going on. Um, I'm going to try and set up the tray. On how I think it's going to look. They've got some holes here, but I'm not sure how it looks. I'm going to have a look at the picture on the box and see how that looks on there. 
Oh, so you put the hairdryer in here. Like that, as far as I know. I don't know what goes in the second slot. Maybe it's just for the hairdryer. But everything else would pretty much just fall through. Um, but yeah, it's hard when you can't really... That goes on there like that. So that'll be for the... This is for these. Like that. Oh, sorry that the camera went out of focus. So... What else goes in that little tray and that, which is very, very cute. And then on the mixing bowl, goes like that with the brush and the clippers. Is that, I don't know, actually, I don't think that is the, I don't think that is hair trimmers, to be fair. I think that's um, a little bottle of, I think it's a little bottle with the hair dye in it. But I thought the top of it reminded me of clippers. But they're going like that. And then I'll put the headbands at the bottom of the trays with the air accessories. I'll put the scissors here. I'll bring it close so you can see what I'm doing. And then I'll put the airbrush at the bottom. And I'll put the airbrush at the top. And the air accessories at the bottom with the little mirror. I think you can actually, oh, that's just a stand for the mirror. I'll put them underneath there and I'll put the straighteners here. That looks so cute and adorable. When it's all set up like that, it looks really, really cute. Um, if you don't want your accessories to fall and fall all over the place, I have a little trick. What I've done for my display. Um, and that is you can double sided you can double side sticky tape the accessories so they don't fall out like they have just now. But yeah, it looks really cute when it's set up, it, it shows all the details of the um trolley or cat. That was the word, cat. But yeah, that looks really cute. Next, I'm gonna show you, well, I'll put the cat in the background. Next, I'm gonna show you the hairdresser pony. Now, I don't know her name because obviously it's in Japan, but one thing I can tell you is the hair is absolutely so soft. I can't get over it how soft it is. And then it comes with this little elastic band, but you can actually style the hair and put um, little grips in. I'm going to try and put a grip in now. So, I'm going to put a hair clip in. And it just simply clicks on like that. It's very fiddly when you're doing stuff on camera. There you go. So you can add some little air accessories. And it actually comes with some little like, instructions. So you can actually plait the hair. And apparently you can put a clip at the top and a clip at the bottom. And it'll hold the plait in. Um, it is actually quite nice length. And it does move and flow really nice. Um, so yeah, it's a really nice blonde colour with a little purple streak. Like I said, they've gone for a very nice purple pastel palette of purples, bluers, pinks and like mint greens. But yeah, it flows really nice. She's got a really cute, adorable face and it's very unusual to get a pony in this type of set. Um, if you're new to Salvanian families, all of the arms move up and down. The head can move side to side and um, she has no other colors other than a little bit of pink in the ear on the actual body itself and she's got these cute little eyes and then she's wearing this really cute apron dress and um, which actually has little pockets in the front of the apron and you can put a scissors in it which are really cute I think that is such a cute little added detail. I think they put loads of detail actually into the figures more than the accessories. Um, 
But yeah, her apron is in this nice little like cottony fabric and it's got two little pockets and it's in a purple colour. And then it's got a silk little purple band going around the dress. And then the underneath the um, pocket is a really nice skirt all attached to one. And it's in a nice sky blue the, um, silk fabric. And then the bow matches and that's in silk. And then the top bit of the dress is in white and purple stripes. Very aesthetic with air dresses with stripes. And then it's got a nice collar in silk white. And then some little bit of lace detailing as well. In white. And the back of the dress is... All of the clothes in Salvanian families that you can use to them um, have got Velcro and you can change all the clothes. So I think that's so cute that it does that. And then she's got this really cute tail which has actually got wiring in it so you can bend it however you want. And the dress is really, really cute. But I ha absolutely love a hair. I think it's so cute and I think it's very unique that Salvanians have come out with that. And as you can see, it flows so nicely. It's not real stiff. It's not got no doll glue in it. Um, and it's got this really nice shape to it. And you can part it. It just feels so soft. I could feel it all day. It's so nice. And I am tempted to take the bobble out just to see what our hair looks like when you move it across. But you can see a little bit there. But I'm just going to keep her hair. I've messed her hair up now. But I'm going to just keep her hair as it is like that for now but her outfit is very very cute and it's just a very cute set and she can um push a trolley um a trolley or a cart but i'm gonna have it as like a little station um hairdresser area just from my grand apartment store till i get my um salon which I can't wait and I can't wait to do a review it's very expensive at the moment it's 78 pounds I don't know why it's that expensive because an average shop for a Sylvanian family's um set like for instance like the supermarket is probably about 20 pounds probably reduced now but it's about 25 pounds maybe 30 pounds so for something to be 78 pounds and I actually think that it was about £80 at one point. So it might go down a little bit, but it's just a bit expensive at the moment. Um, but yeah, so yeah, you can move the legs as well, move the arms and move the head. So you can get some really nice posability with these little critters. And I just think she looks absolutely adorable. And I am, if I was you, I would get your Amazon Japan downloaded and get these ordered because it take it took next to nothing to come they actually ship very fast considering it's coming all the way from japan and it's a nice reasonable price it, it's 20 i think it was like 20 pounds or 23 pounds um so if you love salvanians and you want a an unusual set i would definitely get the um salvanian family's stylish pony set and yeah She's a cute little hairdresser. So I am done with this review. Please like and subscribe to my channel. Hit that alarm bell for more toy related stuff. Because I do a big mixed range of toys on my channel. I do cutesy toys like Sylvanian Families. Squishville. Um, I've done Squeezemals in the past. I've done quite a lot. And then I do other toys like Pokemon. Harry Potter. Jurassic World. So... If you like a big mixed range, please like and subscribe to my channel and get your hands on this cute, amazing set. And I will have more Sylvanian stuff coming up soon and other toy stuff coming up soon. So I am done with this um, review and yeah, my overall thoughts on it quickly before I go is I think it's very lovely. I think it is quite detailed, but it could be a little bit more detailed. Um, but because you already get like an unusual um, figure, I think the pull back on adding the details on the accessories but overall still very cute and adorable so i would like to say 
see you all on the next one. Bye, guys.